Hello everybody, it is me Alice and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be helping you guys find the perfect foundation for your skin tone because a lot of people find it hard to find foundations for their kind of like skin types because some people have oily skin, some people have dry skin, some people have sensitive skin and sometimes like the wrong foundation can make your face look very odd and sometimes foundations can like run off your skin and kind of like flake so today I'll be helping you guys find the correct one with three different processes so without further ado let's go in the video so for the first step I will help you guys find your skin type this includes oily skin, dry skin and sensitive skin so firstly for oily skin you want to feel around your like t-zone area so like your nose, your forehead and your chin your nose area is quite greasy and oily this means that you have oily skin because your skin um, secretes a lot more oil than like usual so this means that you've got oily skin <laughs> like your skin is a little bit flaky and quite dry and a little bit dehydrated that means that you've got dry skin and also maybe moisturise a little bit more as well just to add some moisture back into your skin as well it'll honestly so it helps so much for sensitive skin you may notice that your skin is a little bit red and it's usually quite pink and sore basically just kind of like touch your skin and like if your skin is quite hot and quite red this means that you will have sensitive skin so after you've done that, it's now time to find the right foundation. So starting off with oily skin, the first foundation which is really good is the NYX Stay Matte But Not Flat Foundation. This retails at £7 in boots and they have a wide range of shades which is perfect because not everyone is like the same kind of skin tone. So this is in the shade Ivory, Ivory which I've got which is perfect for pale people and this foundation is quite light, not like um, a heavy duty foundation, this will be perfect for you and it's just like, like it's a bit perfect size as well, it's quite small but it's really cute and this makes your face look being matte which is perfect for oily skin, foundation won't run off your face or anything which is perfect. Next I have the Maybelline Superstay 24 hour foundation, this retails at 9 99 it's super drug and this is like more like a liquidy foundation and this makes your face matte because as you may know all your skin needs matte foundations otherwise foundation will run off your face and it'll, like, it'll have like lines everywhere it's not a nice look. This is the super matte Superstay one and this is like a liquid foundation and literally stays on your skin like for the whole day. Then finally, um, a more higher end foundation is the Kat Von D Locket foundation. As you may know, this is my favourite foundation ever and I use it almost every day. I have it on right now because I've got quite oily skin and this foundation does not come off your skin or run off your face until you use micellar cleansing water. This is perfect and is very heavy however it does last a long time and again they have loads of shades in this I've got probably around 30 shades which is amazing because it shows that it's available for a wide range of diverse people so I love that so for dry skin you need a more like either glowy or like a stick foundation so here I have the Revolution Foundation Stick. You can buy this in Superdrug for £5. Honestly, £5 for this is amazing. And I'm sure they've got around 18 lovely shades in this. So basically, here's a stick. You put it on your face like this. And the reason why it's perfect for dry skin is because you put it on and you blend it. And literally, it like illuminates your face because dry skin is quite dull looking and this adds a lovely glow to it and also <laughs> this stays on dry skin for like ages because like obviously I have oily skin and I use this and within the first three hours this was running off my nose it was actually disgusting but for dry skin this adds a lovely glow and is super long lasting for dry skin so I love that now for sensitive skin sensitive skin is quite sensitive to a lot of chemicals and like moisturizers and just basically everything which you put on your face however this Rimmel Matte Reflection Foundation is very light and 
does not like interfere with like your skin deep down which is very good and this retails for $8.29 and they have a lot of shades in this as well and honestly this is super soft on your skin and it's super light and it just says light perfect radiant foundation because sometimes sensitive skin is quite dull as well so this adds a little bit of radiance to your skin and just makes it nice and glowy and it won't irritate the skin either so please go for this and I've also used this and this is pretty good for oily skin as well however you might have to powder a lot with it but it is very affordable and they have it in, in most supermarkets as well now so I love this. This Garnier BB Cream is a, another good one for sensitive skin because it is super light and I have to put loads on and it's just like it has moisturiser in it so it'll like it'll moisturise your face as well also this is good for dry skin however it, it may kind of like show your dryness up a little bit as well because it like it because this like isn't really like a radiant kind of BB cream however this retails for 9 99 in Boots but the, the bad thing is they only have like two or three shades which obviously isn't good that's quite nice as well yeah so I recommend this and this is perfect for taking on a holiday or or like if you wake up and like you don't have a heavy kind of like foundation on this will be perfect so I love this very good finally for a combination skin so basically a combination skin you could either be oily and dry skin oily and sensitive dry and sensitive it can be like like basically a mix of any kind of like skin types so for combination skin I have the Maybelline Dream Satin Liquid. This is dewy and matte at the same time, which I think is perfect for like oily and dry skin. <laughs> Just because it's some radiance, but like mattifies your face at the same time. And this is $7.99 from Superdrug. This is lovely and like the consistency of this is perfect for like combination skin and it stays on your skin all day so you won't have to like re-powder or reapply any. So I love this, this is really good. The last foundation is the LA Girl Pro Coverage one and this is £10 on Beauty Bay. Obviously this um, is quite hard to find so you have to order it, order it on Beauty Bay. I think that's the only place where you can get it in the UK but this is super good. The coverage is amazing and kind of adds a glow and kind of mattifies your face at the same time again like the other one does. This is super affordable however they only have about four or five shades which obviously for, for like everyone this won't match everyone's skin, however, if you do tan quite easily, this will be perfect for you because I have got quite darker shades. But yeah, I love this and this is perfect for combination skin. So the final step is basically finding the right shade for you. So sometimes foundations aren't in stock, like in your local like Superdrug or Boots or any makeup store. So sometimes people order the foundation online. I would not recommend this just because you can't obviously like test the foundation like online and like you know kind of like keep it so basically this means that like you have to order it online and then take it home and and sometimes like you wear it and you're like oh my god it's either too light or too dark and obviously you can't return it once you've opened the product so something that like i would recommend is maybe find an alternative foundation or maybe get like um, a cheap foundation so for example the revolution foundation the rimmel foundation like either a lighter or a darker shade and mix it with the foundation that you've already got and honestly this will help find your right skin tone for foundation like perfectly you could get the revolution like drops so basically they have like the white ones and then they have darker ones and then you mix it with the foundation that you've got and you'll either make it lighter or darker. Good way to test like like to see if your foundation matches your skin like is to test it on your neck and not the, the back of your hand because the neck is the same shade as your face. So guys I hope this video has helped you find the right foundation for your skin type and if it has please leave some comments down below and thumbs up the video and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Every day, every day, every day, every day, every day.